Money on the floor, let's get straight to it, baby. The gameplay that you see in the background is from the boy Chico Filo. Link will be down in the description. I would have liked to do Brood or whatever, but he's just in the builder right now, and I figured y'all want to see some gameplay, gameplay, what have you. So here we are, man. Look, check it out. We got some information for y'all this morning, man, and so we just going to go through it, and uh, we just we just going to hit it just like this, bro. Look, check it out. Bam, the first things first. I pop and freaks all the honeys. The, hey, Stack says, be careful streaming early. I think they're striking down channels. So if you're doing something, proceed with caution. But if you're in New Zealand, you should be okay. They typically don't mess with anybody once the first people get the game. Normally, once the first people get the game, you know, they go ahead and they just say, hey, it's a free-for-all. Get your views, do your thing, what have you. But, you know, this is just that one. And I don't want anybody to be like, yo, why is he doing it? And they got me. And, they, you know, what ha that, that thing happens. And so I just want y'all to know that... Be careful, govern yourselves accordingly, and, and do your thing. Up next, we got the boy Ticino. The boy Ticino, look, look, man, hey, he's saying some good stuff. We're going to see if he follows through on it. But uh, he says, I'm 100% locked to grind and remind everyone who I am in 2K23. That means YouTube videos are back, and I'll be active on all platforms. The journey begins with a 16-hour stream on day one as soon as the game drops officially in six hours for me in New Zealand. See y'all. See you there. What he say? Meet me there. Beat me there, bro. And then uh, you got Joe Knows. The boy Joe Knows say we got everybody back. Let's make it a great year. Yardman Gaming says this year has potential to be the greatest uh, we've we've had in a long time and now uh, you know melly why uh, see you know the w tycino all that right there man so look we got a lot of people back in the community uh you know it, it's it's gonna be one of those things my thing is this to me the game and the community has been there my problem is I don't want people to come out get everybody excited everybody's this this and that and then in two days y'all talking about the game and that's the only thing that we don't want y'all just be like man the game that's this this and that and then y'all kill it for the people that want to stay in the community that's the only thing that i don't want to see but hey and then right here you see chico filo showing the stage man i think he said this is the current gen stage right here so uh yeah it, it's pretty I, I don't know man we're gonna see how current gen is man a lot of people are saying they're gonna start out on current gen uh but most people from what we're seeing are saying they're gonna start out on next gen and with that being the case i think that's gonna be dope because I think they got they even got a fives in the stage. They got a fives in the stage for 1250. Hey, I ain't gonna lie, man. That might be tough. I I, I ain't gonna lie that. You know what I'm saying? That, that, that might be pretty tough right there, man. Y'all let me know what y'all think is in the WRL fives in the stage on current gen for 1250. Uh would you play it? But I think it'll be a lot less, lot less possible to cheese with the fives in the stage but hey that's just what i'm thinking uh i have not seen next gen stage anybody got that y'all let me know we're gonna put that up but uh like i said bro i think that that the content creators have to realize that as we go so goes the community if you're saying that current gen is the best people gonna go to current gen if you say that that next gen is the best and that you, you're gonna fight through it and try to play it and learn the game then people gonna go to next gen people are going to watch what you put out but if the bigger guys just say the game and then they just stop playing all together then you know the community be in in somewhat trouble but like i said i'm a content creator now i feel like i have found a way to break through it doesn't matter to me if the game is going to be good bad or indifferent i'm focused on creating content i'm focused on creating story related content and stuff like that and speaking of which if y'all do nothing else man make sure y'all like the video because every time y'all like the video it helps us get closer to that also oh coveted 100k sometimes people don't even see the video because the people that saw the video first haven't liked it so make sure y'all like it make sure y'all comment first second all that good stuff down there and uh you know we're gonna get this thing popping it's gonna be a great year of 2k up next man we got we got the jump shot creator man and uh you know the jump shot creator the one thing i want y'all to pay attention to the most is as he's creating the jump shot it shows you in that bottom right hand corner what you are required in order to use the shot so like right now um and, and a lot of these joints a lot too it looks like it looks like all of the all of the uh, jump shots are not unlocked so it's not just free jump shots you know it used to just be free ass jump shots that's what we would have we would have the jump shot created in there and, and we would be good but uh, it doesn't appear that we got that right now uh, what we got right now is you're gonna have to unlock these jump shots I don't know if it's it, it looks like it's unlocked by whatever your current stuff is so 
who knows? I don't know exactly how it goes. I don't think you're gonna have to buy it or nothing, but it just, it looks like it's gonna be locked according to your current ability or what have you. And so you see right there, like uh, he's going through it. Let me see the ones that are locked. Let's see if, if those was red. Uh, because it says, nah, it doesn't say why those are locked. Oh, yes, it does right here. It says why they're locked. Cause you gotta, you gotta meet the certain requirements. So you gotta meet those requirements. And then see that one he can get, but it's still locked. That's weird. Un unless it's like, hold on, let's, 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 let's make sure. Let's make sure. I want to see one of them that turns green. Okay, unlock. Okay, the ones that are unlocked, you already you already have the stuff that it takes. So it's default small, and then you can do all of that. But the ones that are locked, you don't. It's that's, he doesn't meet the requirements for. Cool. Makes perfect sense to me. I'm with it. I think this is gonna be something that's cool, man. I, I I really wish that the jump shot creator was like it was, and that it was just free jump shots for all. You can just make anything that you want to. But I understand what they're trying to do with the game. They want to make it one of those deals where. Well, they're going to limit you without without explicitly limiting you. I can dig it, man. It is what it is. Like I said, I'm always willing to try something new as long as it's implemented properly. It appears that it's implemented properly. Looks like you can still like uh, look with the left, right, and it looks like it's pretty much dead, but it did last year until, uh, until AO Pass broke the game. Then when he broke the game, then everybody started doing it once they played him and they got ass whooped. So, you know, it is what it is. Um, looks like contested shots are not going in, but nobody got badges yet. Nobody got anything yet. Uh, paint mashing is going to be at an all time high. We know how this thing goes, bro. So it is what it is. I don't think that it's, it's time to panic. I think we just need to get out here, learn the game, figure this stuff out, and then we'll go from there. Um, and, and really, I, I think that we just got to give it time and it's going to be something different. So we just need to adjust accordingly. Up next, we got the boy. Uh, you know, NBA 2K leaks and Intel. He's got the legend grind requirements. 100,000 points in Pro-Am or Rec games. That's that's the first thing you got to do. Well, that's one of the f first things you have to do. Then you got to have 500 games as GOAT status. I'm not going to get that by proxy. I don't. I think I was, I think I wasn't GOAT a goat the whole year. I think I might have been silver or gold the whole year just because you play lock. Uh, but maybe those requirements will have changed. Even though I had a 92 win percentage and like an 88 win percentage on Xbox, a 92 on on PlayStation, it, I never reached goat status. And I think I think they might have changed some of those requirements uh, for goat status because the the requirements for Team Take uh, have been changed up a little bit too. So we know who who knows. But you got to have 12 season quests completed. You just do just do a bunch of quests, man. Brute, Brute be doing quests like he the quest god. So, you know, I'm talking about quest love. So he good. Um, you should be able to do that relatively easily. And then the last one, but not least, earn 20, earn prizes across 20 events in the city. So your only limited factor is just going to be really, I guess, your points. I mean, like, it, it's just a lot of stuff to do. Um, I think the easiest thing to do are going to be the quests and then the events. You just got to participate in the events and and do decently and you're going to um, you're going to win some prizes. You know, I mean just like it's not saying you have to win the actual event. It's just saying you got to win a prize in the event. And most of the time, you know, when you go to an event or what have you, uh what's it going to be like 20 weeks or something like that. So I mean it's still going to take a little while or however often they have events. It's still going to take a little while, but I don't think it's impossible. And if you're in the rec, uh, you know, you're playing a lot of rec games. It's going to take a lot of, it's going to take a lot of rec games, man. But I mean, the average person that probably does it, they're probably going to score 25, 30 points in the rec, something like that. that, that it's, it's not going to be that hard to get to 100,000 points. And then, like I said, you just, it just depends on the game that you play and all of that stuff, what type of game you play. Some people put up 50 in the rec, so that's not going to be hard for them at all. Um, you know, it just, it just really depends on the play player that you are but i do like that if you want to go for legend there are no limiting factors you just get to go for legend up next we got the season one rewards man check it out so bam you know you got your you got the season one you got the ball and tee, you get that the player indicator the jump shot meter uh you get the green wings i will be using these green i'm using all of the trash stuff the, the, the wings you get this uh, the, uh emote pack uh, some my team stuff, you know, they want us to go to my team, all that good stuff. Hey, the Dr. Disrespect black steel mullet and headphones. Fun fact, Dr. Disrespect will bust nine out of nine of y'all asses in, in real life basketball. Y'all probably think Doc is just a gamer. Bro, Doc was a semi-pro basketball player. This dude can shoot, dribble, 
get on that rim. Like, he's like 6'8", too. And then, like, my guy, 8 thought. I think Doc might be 6'9". No, Doc's 6'8". And 8 Thoughts is like 6'7". 8 Thoughts will bust y'all too. And it just ain't no fun. Like, they be putting, they was putting up videos when we was in, with Machinima where they were just playing around and they were just killing kids. But they played in the semi-pro league in um in California, so together. So I know I know them boys is tough. So we still got the COVID mask, the 2-3 COVID mask. Uh, we got, you know, Pascal Siakam back plate. We got uh, inside defense. We got player indicator. You got another emote pack. Hopefully they got some standing emotes, man. We got the clear face mask, the LeBaron James clear face mask. Hopefully they're gonna have the um, what would you call it, the the, the Batman face mask that they made them stop using. We got the shoe pack. Uh, you got you know arm stuff. You got double XP, Doctor Disrespect prototypes. You know the, the the Google lens prototype. But I wonder why they why why they going so heavily with oh because Doctor Disrespect rocks with Mountain Dew and so Mountain Dew is one of their sponsors so they got to put him in here. It makes perfect sense to me. The uh the MJ23 backpack, another emote pack. At least they're giving us some emotes, man. But I seen somebody out there with the life jacket already. It's a flood one. Now actually it's Chico with the life jacket already, but it's not this one right here. I guess he bought it as part of his drip. Uh, you get the Mountain Dew bike, uh, trike. Uh, a plus one ball handling, and then you get the Doctor Disrespect Showtime vest. I'm gonna have all the cheese stuff on, man. I'm gonna have all this stuff that make me look like a fucking bot on, bro. I'm not gonna lie to you. So you know, and then y'all gonna be thinking I'm trash, and you gonna run up, and then you gonna get ass whooped. Like that's just really how it's gonna happen. But um, and then you got the Doom buggy. Oh, uh, the, the four seater golf, the four seater golf cart. So. I wonder if it's gonna really be four seater. So like when we go from, I mean, obviously get your extra badge points. So y'all know how that's gonna work in your stuff uh, on on your bills. But I wonder when you get that, when you get the four seater golf cart, um, what is it gonna be? Like, uh, are, are we really going to be able to ride four people in the golf cart? Or is it just gonna be like four, or is it just a four seater, but not really a four seater? Y'all understand what I'm saying? Like, like, are we gonna be able to travel across the city? Like I said, we wanna say we wanna go to another park. I can jump on the golf cart and we can just ride out and I can just chill while we get there and it makes sure that we get to the same thing. It's not gonna be splitting us up across servers and stuff like that. If so, that's genius because you know if you take fast travel, it, it might not take us to the same spot. And I mean, four seater, you know, that's dope right there. Um, y'all let me know if y'all think that's a WRL in the uh, in the comment section. Um, one more thing we got for y'all, man. We got the the JP4, JP4, all right. He got the badge tier list. I will have the link to this in the description. Somebody asked me about it yesterday. I did not put it up. I am so sorry about that, but I will have it. And uh, he said, once again, study Laker fan, uh, YT and other bill videos to create this. Some slots are missing, missing, but we'll update it um, when the game drops tomorrow in Australia. And so the link for this will be in the description. And the very last thing I got for y'all, man, is that boy Chico Filo is telling y'all what the best jump shots are, or the fastest jump shots that we got so far. Let's take a listen. If it if it goes, will, will it will it will it roll? Don't don't tell me it's already gone. It's, it's there. Why why is it not playing? Come on, man. Don't tell me it got squashed. All right, there we go. Bro, went one of seven, bro. bro, bro All right, here we one go. One of seven is crazy. That was more like one of three from Thanes. Come on, that wasn't that bad. Yeah, Emmanuel quickly. Kyle Kuzma and Lamella Ball, the three fastest jump shots. I'm gonna let him say it again real quick. Oh, yeah. Kyle Kuzma and Lamella Ball, the three fastest not bad. Yeah, Emmanuel quickly. Kyle Kuzma and Lamella Ball, the three fastest jump. So he said, Emmanuel quickly, Lamella Ball, and Kyle Kuzma are the three fastest jump shots. So this is information straight to the second that y'all are getting here, man. So I know that deserve a like, man. But look, though. I am just happy that we got a game that people are excited about. But 2K22 started off like this also before it went crazy. It looks like 2K has gone a long way to keep us from cheesing and to keep us honest with the game. Obviously, somebody's going to break the game before long. I seen Chalk out there dribbling crazy. You know you got a lot of people out there doing their thing, man. But you know what? It's, it's all good. It's all love. That's what we're supposed to do. But Mike said, no matter what they do, we will try to patch this thing and we're going to get it back right, man. So y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section, man. Is it a W or L? Make sure y'all like the video. Like the video. Like the video. Um, and I'm going to holler at y'all next time. Till next time. It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK, the People's Champ. Guys, speak.